Hi, Bill here and welcome to Bill's Retro Reviews. Today we'll be looking at Transformers bootleg of G1 Broadside. And here it is here. And I'll take a close look up of it. That's it there. It is a bootleg. I used to have the original. And there it's there. It doesn't have all the parts with it, unfortunately. All the accessories. I know it comes with two of the same type of accessories. Accessories, which I'll show off in a minute. There it is there, underneath. I think that used to stay in, but the bootleg doesn't. Very, very stiff. Stays out very strongly. But I think it used to just click in in the original. But this one doesn't. And this likes to flop around, so there it is. That's it. So, uh, there's nothing more to do in that mode. They don't have any jets or nothing. I don't think you get any with the... I know the Titans Return one you did, but with this one you don't. Um, so, just turn it, in to, turn it into the jet. What you've got to do is move that up there like that. Peg it in. Move this back section up like this. Peg it in. Turn it over. Straighten these tail wings out. And lift up the tail fins and take the unhook the wings move it back unhook the wings move it back like that now unfortunately this doesn't have a tail uh, a nose wheel i think the original had a nose wheel that's a tail, a, a nose wheel. It doesn't have a nose, the landing, nose, landing gear, a nose wheel. It doesn't have, so, and these are the, obviously, moulded in ones at the back it would have. So, that's it. That's it. It also doesn't have any missiles. I think the original had missiles or holes either side there for them. But this one doesn't come with any. Because it's just a bootleg. Okay. Right, so that's it. You see the decals on it. You can see how crummy they look. They're not that great compared to the original G1. And uh, it's not even got the proper Autobot. It's just that kind of one. It's weird. Uh, so that's it. There's not much more to say about that. So let's get it transformed up into robot mode. Very simple. Move these up. Rotate them. The one thing I will say about this bootleg one is these are separate. These move up separate. The original bootleg, uh, the original, start again. The original, they move in one go. I don't think they move separate to each other, but the bootleg, it moves separate, which is pretty cool. So, it's one slight feature that the original doesn't have. So you move them up, you collapse, you peg these back into where they were before, and you push that back there, this sits back there, and you pull out the arms. So everything's the same with this for the G1, except it's missing a few bits, the stickers are not as great, and obviously it has independent moving feet that the original does not have. Uh, I think the original has a moving head, this one doesn't. And that's it. And of course, this is very loose, so it'll just flop, it'll just do its own thing. Now, this is what this is different about this. It comes with an axe, but this came with two axes. I don't know if it's supposed to come with a gun and an axe, but this thing just came with two axes. So you just put the axe in the hand, like this. Very stiff. And you can come with two axes. Like that. Chop, 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 chop. Or, if you want, there's enough room in there, I think, to fit the two. No, there isn't. I thought there'd be enough room to fit as a double-bladed bl axe, but, but no, there isn't. So it just comes like that, and that's it, basically. It's just a matter of chop, 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 chop. So, it has double axe action this one has, compared to 
uh, the original, which I think comes with a gun. But anyway, so that's it. So I'll just quickly get it back to um, aircraft carrier and end the video. Take it like that, that, put them in, like this, straighten these out. You can uh, push them in like that, I guess, and that will stop them flopping. And there we are, back into submarine mode. Uh, submarine? Aircraft carrier mode. I don't know what I'm talking about today. <laughs> Oh dear. Right, that's it. And it comes with these two weapons there. And that is that. So, that has been my review of a bootleg of the G1 broadside. And with the two same weapons. And you've seen what uh, differences that has. Oh, one other thing I forgot to do. Hold on, I'll do it. Give me a quick transform. Right, size comparison. That's again with six gun, and he's actually stands taller. I've actually got him standing on his uh, little wing bits. That might, instead of it flopping around like this, you can hold it in and it makes him slightly taller. So he's almost as tall. He actually is the same height as a uh, Siege six gun. Which I think is either a Legends or Deluxe, I'm not 100% sure on. I think it may be Legends class size. So he's clearly coming up same head height. Okay, so now I can end the video. That's me, I'll end it just like that. Right, thank you, bye. Look out for my next videos that are coming. Thanks, bye.